Hello, YouTubers. This is Anubifier. It's Friday, and as usual, that means an update on the roadmap. This one had a minor change in the labeling, but it still only extends to Q3 2020. Let's take a look. This shouldn't take too long. We start with patch 310, which was adjusted. Usually, large number changes correspond to major changes, which, spoiler, the original patch 4.0 wasn't really a big change, so it was changed. 310 starts with Eddie Parr, the mission giver bartender at Wally's within New Babbage at 39 of 50. New Babbage is getting a buff to its shops at 11 of 23. And Grim Hex is getting that rework that they spoke about a month ago on SC Live at 41 of 65. AI FPS weapon choices and AI cover choices are both listed as polishing. Gameplay has seven entries. The refactor to the elevator UI with a new holographic interface is scheduled. AI targeting methodology is 14 of 17. Body dragging mechanics, 13 of 20. High speed combat, nine out of 10. Ship HUD refactor is two of eight. Law surrender V2 is three of six. And the no-go net over major landing zones is getting adjusted and that's at eight of 12. The Cuddy Blue is two of 10. The updated M50 is zero of eight and there are three new player weapons and one ship weapon. 311 is Q3 2020 and has a new listing for a refinery deck, a new station type to deal with raw mineables. 10 of 17 is the teased cargo decks as part of expanded cargo gameplay. Amongst other things, it's designed to add time to cargo transfer. AI lists ship hazard avoidance and a polished FPS combat, both listed as scheduled. Throw is listed as six of 10. Object push pull is scheduled. Missile Operator Mode is scheduled. Ship to Station and Ship to Ship Docking is scheduled. Better Death Ragdoll animations are scheduled. The Mercury Star Runner is 9 of 99. I'm really looking forward to that. And we close out with attachments for the multi-tool and one player serviceable grenade launcher. Boom. That's it. Fly safe and I'll see you in the verse.